remind you to live your life in a way that is independent of the outside world. Along our journey as we grow, as we evolve, as we change, we find ourselves confronted with certain ideas that we either now believe or that we no longer believe. And in doing so, we begin to see or explore not only what we truly believe within, the choices that we've made, but we also begin to see how we've allowed outside influences to have some authority in our journey. And I want to remind you to know that you have the ultimate control. You have the authority to say what you will and will not interact with. You have the authority to say what you will and will not abide by. You have the authority to choose what brings you peace. And you owe it to nobody but self to give yourself said peace. You owe it to nobody but self to remind yourself of your own authority and how much you truly have. That is, I mean, it's inherently part of the divine essence that is you, that we are given from our creator. In reconnecting with this part of who we truly are, we see that more often than not, we will disconnect from what's going on in the outside world. And by disconnect, I mean, step back, be able to see the things that are happening, the goings on of the outside world, but not so much internalize it, not work hard to place ourselves in the midst of what is happening outside of us. The more you make choices for your life and your, your reality, you're more often than not guided towards things that bring you a calmer life. That's what's calm to you. See what brings a peace or a certain element of calmness to someone else could be extreme sports. It could be stunts. It could be uh, (laughs) a, You name it, whatever under the sun. But that's where they find their peace. And it's a beautiful thing. So I want to remind you to find what's peaceful for you. Don't judge yourself. Don't critique yourself. Don't compare yourself. Simply take time to understand what gives you peace of mind, clarity of heart. And nourish that, nourish that choice, nourish that idea, nourish that mode of expression unapologetically. And in do so, not only do we allow ourselves space to grow within, but allows us to share that grace that we give ourselves with others. Doesn't mean they're going to appreciate it. Don't matter. By filling up your cup of grace, your cup runneth over. So you have grace to spare. So remind yourself of the power that you do have along your journey. Find that peace within. Find that mode of expressing said peace, said love for self. More importantly, relax. Everything's all right. Happens at its own appointed time. Until next time, be blessed.